to a developing court case that took a violent turn today. You know you did it! You know you did it! That's family members attacking accused killer Leon Davis in Polk County. They're outraged that the judge declared a mistrial and are demanding justice for two women set on fire, alive, and killed. Our Scott Draper is live in the newsroom tonight with more of the video and why the judge threw out the case today, Scott. Good evening. The mistrial happened after a paramedic testified. One victim told him there was no doubt in her mind that Davis was the attacker. Now, since the victim is dead and can't be questioned, the judge declared a mistrial, which caused the victim's family to lash out. After years of preparing and five days of testimony, the trial of Leon Davis was declared a mistrial. With that, the anger of the victim's family boiled over. You know you did it! You know you did it! Maybe see it? You know you did it! The courtroom was cleared, but the damage was done. Everything came to a head earlier when the prosecution called a Polk County EMT to the stand to testify about what victim Yvonne Bustamante told him while he was treating her the night she was attacked. I hear this voice ask her, do you know who did this to you? What is her reaction? She raised up on the stretcher and emphatically stated, Leon Davis, without any doubt in her mind, Defense attorneys immediately stopped the trial, and with that, the EMT knew he had misspoke. That testimony would come back to haunt the state, leading to the judge's decision to declare a mistrial. The reason? The EMT's testimony was an interpretation rather than an exact account, and because the victim died, the defense could not cross-examine. The judge made sure the EMT knew what his words had done. Well, what you said is such fundamental error that I had to declare a mistrial. Von Bustamante's parents couldn't hold back their anger over the announcement, ultimately trying to attack Davis. I understand the feelings that victims have, but to, you know, try to attack somebody in the courtroom is something I've never seen. Now, we are told the state will reach high Leon Davis, but it likely won't happen until after the first of the year. Reporting live in the newsroom, Scott Draper, ABC Action News.